Hey guys, let's get more news about Dallas, but first, don't forget to subscribe and leave your like. Cowboys reveal interest in signing Saquon Barkley or Derrick Henry. The Dallas Cowboys are interested in signing either Saquon Barkley of the New York Giants or Derrick Henry of the Tennessee Titans, reports claim as NFL free agency is about to open, but the reports come with a massive if the Cowboys could be interested in Saquon Barkley and Derrick Henry, ESPN reports on the eve of Monday's legal tampering period opening, if their prices drop. This is frankly a clever way to craft a wildly unlikely story, because it features not only the headline-grabbing duo of Barkley and Henry, but also the headline-worthy inclusion of a third name. Captain Obvious We can testify for a fact, actually, that one of the could-be-slash-if angles of ESPN's claim can be eliminated right now, the Cowboys won't be interested in this level of upgrade if the contractual asking price shrinks. The Cowboys will absolutely, positively be interested in signing Barkley if no other team meets his projected contract price, which we put at $12 million annually for a three-year deal. And the Cowboys will absolutely, positively be interested in signing Henry if no other team meets his projected contract price, which we put at $9 million annually for a two-year deal. Unfortunately, so will most every other team. Also unfortunately, while the running back market is flooded with talent which could eventually help Dallas sign somebody, think the re-signing of Tony Pollard at, say, $6 million APY, with a source telling CowboysSI.com that such a move is indeed a top consideration, Barkley, at 27, doesn't figure to suffer much. And Henry, 30, the two-time rushing champ, doesn't plan to. So, would Dallas be interested in a bargain basement priced Barkley or Henry? In the same way, as we've long joked, we'd be interested in dating Halle Berry, that is a Cowboys yes. Cowboys trade of Michael Gallup, has Dallas found a landing spot for WR? The Dallas Cowboys have cemented in their plan to say goodbye to receiver Michael Gallup, who has been granted permission to seek his own trade and who one way or another is scheduled to be off the Dallas roster in the coming days. And maybe Gallup has already found himself a suitor. Gallup experienced a breakout year in his second season of 2019, with 66 receptions for 1,107 yards. But he tore his ACL in 2021, and even with the injury Dallas gave him a five-year, $57.5 million contract, a move that did not work out. The third-round draft pick from 2018 has experienced a drastic decline in production, as last season he had career lows in yards, 418, and touchdowns, 2, and the second-fewest catches, 34. Gallup now has a cap hit of $13.85 million for 2024. A trade doesn't actually provide much relief there. A post-June 1 designated release would give Dallas $9.5 million in 2024 cap space at that time, with the impact spread over two years. Dallup's search for a new team, according to ESPN, has piqued the interest of the Carolina Panthers, though given the hard numbers, the idea of Carolina picking up Gallup's salary, plus Dallas saving so little, plus MG's lack of production, we are skeptical about any team wishing to sacrifice anything for the player, knowing he's on the verge of being cut. Cowboys owner Jerry Jones has tried to be coy about the plan, but it's never been much of a secret. We don't have a decision that we would like to talk about right now, Jones said recently. It's one that we will be going over with him. Nothing we would say without him being involved. We need to sit down and go over stuff with him before we talk about what we're going to do with him. We know what Dallas is about to do with good soldier Gallup, though we would add that there remains a possibility that the Cowboys could someday bring him back under the terms of a new, cheap deal. Cowboys, predicted to add 37 TD wide receiver in 2024. The Dallas Cowboys can address the wide receiver group in a major way this offseason, and one direction includes a record-breaking prospect. While the team still has to determine the futures of players like Michael Gallup and Brandon Cooks, Zachary Franklin could be the kind of addition that doesn't depend on releases or other moves.
In the latest 2024 NFL mock draft from SB Nation, Franklin is being mocked to the Cowboys at the number 231 pick in the seventh round. The former UTSA and Ole Miss receiver stock has fallen dramatically after this past year, but he's also not far removed from his record-setting seasons in San Antonio. It may not be as pressing of a need right now, but receiver is a spot the Cowboys should probably look to address in this draft at some point, the March 7 article states. And with Zachary Franklin being available at this stage, it's an easy decision to make. Not too long ago, Franklin was a star at UTSA. He set program records his junior season, and then reset those records a year later. Franklin then opted to use his extra year of eligibility, due to the pandemic eligibility freeze, and transfer to Ole Mississippi. However, an injury early in the year impacted Franklin's ability to find a spot on the depth chart, and he only appeared in four games. In terms of value, Franklin in a late round could be tremendous value. When Franklin transferred to Ole Miss, there was plenty of hype. Back in July of 2023, he was named a top 10 wide receiver prospect for the 2024 NFL Draft by Pro Football Focus. This was primarily due to his 2021 and 2022 seasons, where he exploded for the Roadrunners. Sports reference shows that he caught 81 passes for 1,027 yards and 12 touchdowns in 2021. In his senior season, he one-upped his previous year with 94 receptions, 1,136 yards, and 15 TDs. Franklin set UTSA records for all three categories in both seasons. But he stumbled when making the jump to the Rebels. During fall camp, Franklin suffered an undisclosed injury and then missed the first three games. Another issue arose later in the season, keeping him off the field for several more weeks. By the end of the year, he had only four catches for 38 yards and one touchdown. Between Michael Gallup, Brandon Cooks, and Jalen Tolbert, there is significant potential for a WR shakeup. Gallup and Tolbert appear to be cut candidates, while Cooks could be traded as heavies recently covered. Bleacher reports Christopher Knox wrote up a proposal that would send Cooks to the Cleveland Browns. In return, the Cowboys will get a fifth-round pick in this year's NFL Draft. Cooks has history with Browns QB Deshaun Watson, 4-1. While he wasn't a dud signing, his $8 million salary stands out compared to what he offers. If Dallas wants to save that cap space, a trade would be the best way to get value out of the situation. And you, fan, what do you think of the situation Zachary Franklin? Leave your opinion in the comments.